Hey YouTube, before the video starts, I just want to let y'all know, man, 98% of y'all aren't subscribed. Now, if you ain't subscribed, subscribe. It takes three seconds, and y'all will be getting mad content. Talk about Blueface, talk about rappers like Lil Baby, Drake, more to come, man. Now, let's get back to the video. Hey YouTube, what's going on? It's your Mikey coming at y'all with a brand new video. Now, look, man, I don't know if y'all remember. Matter of fact, not even remember. Y'all do remember. YW Melly, man. Now, obviously... If y'all don't remember or if y'all do you know what i'm saying um obviously y'all know that back in 2019 um the ywm melly around 2018 2019 i say it was an incident well not an incident because unfortunately two people died i believe um and, and it said that him his boy basically uh i believe like had killed uh they had killed two of his like his boys one was named YNW Sack Chaser, and then the other one was YNW Juvie. This obviously happened in 2018. Um, basically, he 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 got he got he ended up getting arrested and stuff. And basically, from what it said is, what the court is saying is like pretty much they shot him. You know what I'm saying? He, oh, matter of fact, I forgot to mention him and basically another rapper. Um they they both uh it's it's said that they both uh actually tried to not try they they killed them um rest in peace to both of them um and yeah so as of now they're locked up they've been locked up since 2018 2019 and uh it's kind of uh I i've been seeing this I i've been following it for a minute because you know what i'm saying i already mess with ywm melly's uh music like i already do like all his shit like about his old shit too like i fuck with him i listen to him here there but it kind of sucks because i like giving people the, i like giving people the benefit of the doubt but it depends you know what i'm saying like if it's like a sexual so I, I i try to play both cards but it's so sensitive that like i don't even like like giving my opinion on those type of cases because it's like bro like if it's if the person did commit some you know say sexual act on a person obviously the the r word um it's wrong obviously and um i think that person should come whatever's coming to them you know what I'm saying whether it's um uh jail time fucking uh uh, uh de the death penalty you name it you know what i'm saying i don't care like i have no sympathy for those type of people right but in situations like these all you can say is yeah they killed him yeah this happened but i don't know if it happened or not like this is really one of those things where it's innocent to prove guilty because bro like you don't really know like you know, you know what i'm saying like you don't really know what really fucking happened and after time went by i, I believe 2020 came went by you know what i'm saying 2021 and now in 2022 has been like right what two to four years has passed since they've been locked up or since melly has been locked up and on top of that, I don't know if y'all know, but a couple months ago, they were saying how basically Melly had his teeth and he, he was getting an affection. I was hearing something about his jail had people with STDs. Some wild shit, you know what I'm saying? I was seeing a lot of wild shit. And to this day, I still think about like, damn, like if a person, you know, if an individual has an affection because of his, you know what I'm saying, grills or whatever, I feel like that should be handled like something should happen like I don't know if he's better now or like if something has changed during this time but when I heard that I was kind of amazed that nothing was changing or nothing was happening like bro like it ain't even got to be no crazy shit but bro get that get that man some medical attention bro that's all I'll be saying like I don't know bro um but yeah and then 2022 comes around which is now and originally they had said that they was giving him the death penalty and then it ended up the the, the I, I believe I, I was it the state it was either the state or the court they were basically saying that uh no you can't do that you basically can't put this like you can't try to punish him for with with death penalty because you gave a late notice um but come come to find out um uh not so long ago i believe a week ago or less it is being said florida appeals court ruled wednesday that ywm melly could face a death penalty convicted in his upcoming murder trial overturning a judge's decision that prosecutors forfeited the right to seek capital punishment now that that says that says enough 
it, it's coming back on the table it, it unfortunately is coming back on the table they also say when a trial looming this past summer judge andrew siegel ruled that the prosecutors couldn't see the death penalty because they had failed to give many his attorneys proper notice that they plan to do so violating strict state rules but in a ruling on wednesday florida district court of appeal ruled the judge's decisions was incorrect since prosecutors gave notice that they might seek death when they first charged Melly in 2019 they had complied with state rules notice is notice the court wrote in its opinion now this is really crazy because initially i was thinking oh nah it's out the table it's out like yo Melly is like there's something that we don't know because clearly they're taking off the the, the table this whole time in reality it was simply over the 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 rules and 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 shit and i was thinking the whole time oh nah they, they just don't got enough proof to you know what i'm saying give him the death penalty so that's why they took it out mm -mm, that's wrong come to find out indeed it was just about some bullshit strict laws that basically they ended up giving late notice when in reality they didn't they they, they gave it on the right time when they had arrested him now that's pretty fucking crazy now it, it, it kind of leaves Melly in in a weird position or not even a weird position but it's kind of fucking it, it's, it's sticky it, it, it's fucking sticky i don't know um obviously Melly's Melly's attorney philip r horowitz said he and his client were disappointed in the ruling but look forward to our opportunity to argue our position before the justices i don't know as i said it, it's still uh, I, I don't even know the exact time that he's gonna get away for trial like it's he's still awaiting for trial and i wonder when the first case is gonna happen because at this point that's been what two to four years already that he served jail time the, 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 who knows if like one he's proven guilty and if he is proven guilty how much time is he getting or is he getting the death penalty on top of that two could be the other option is if he's innocent but what is being said um obviously from what initially was said basically they argued or or, or melly basically argued and i guess his lawyer that basically something it was a shooting that had happened a drive-by they basically got shot and his both both dot his both uh both of his boys died um and then obviously the you know what I'm saying the the prosecutors are trying to prosecute him are saying no basically they killed him from the back um they killed him from the back in the car and basically they took him belly his boy took him to the hospital basically that's how it ended up happening they ended up getting arrested because yeah that that happened on, honest on, on top of that it's rumors well it, it yeah it is a rumor it is said that now nah, i don't even want to say the rumor but people said that basically if it did happen it, it happened because his boys were talking shit about his mom i'm not really exactly sure so i'm not gonna don't even quote me on that i'm not sure i could be completely completely wrong so you just take that with a grain of salt take that with a 10 percent chance of being true because who knows right I, that's all i was hearing during these couple years that's what basically quote unquote happened if it did happen um as i said i hope whatever happens happens whether it's he's found guilty or not i want i want i want it to come out to light because if he is innocent that he's innocent and and he should be free now if he isn't guilty i believe whatever is whatever he is found guilty with he he deals you know what i'm saying he he gets prosecuted you know what i'm saying I, i'm not one of those people that is like yo free free him right like i fuck with Melly heavy but the reality is you can't sit here and make it seem like he's just automatically innocent i will say innocent to prove guilty but you can't just think with the free him free him bro if he killed that person you're still gonna say free him regardless you know what i'm saying i don't know um all i'm gonna say is i hope whatever happens happens um innocent to prove guilty um i hope i hope whatever happens happens as i said uh all the luck to melly whatever happens happens um and yeah that's gonna be the end y'all did enjoy like subscribe comment um what y'all think y'all y'all think he's innocent y'all think he's guilty let me know in the comments man i'll catch y'all in the next one man peace
Bring your blood like a dryer, then with it up like a firefighter. TP, pass me the new ride, busting enough. Think I'm like, you see me, you better just stop. Oh, club with a hundred, I'm cool with dumb. Try to run up, try him off. Send him the AJ, we gon' fly him off. Don't like JT, tryna wrap him up. Got me a raps, we know that you a bluff. Got me a